Hey everyone, today I'm filming my October favorites, so let's just get started. I have really random favorites this month, but that's okay. So the very first thing I have been loving is this Asparin. This is a loose face powder, and this is the original formula. <coughs> With this product, I have been baking my face. Now, I actually bought the Ben Nye Banana Powder, and I actually have just been leaning more towards this one. Now, baking my face, what I do is when I contour, I uh, draw a line under my contour, and I do it under my eyes and on my forehead, and it just highlights those areas, um, and plus it makes like your um, contour and everything really crisp. So when I really want like my makeup out there, I have been using this powder, which was only like 5 or $6 at Walmart, which is a really good deal. And I got natural, um, so that's just the one I have picked up. I know I wanted to get the one in translucent, and that's the one that people use to bake their face, but I have not found translucent. But natural works the same as um, when you're using it to bake your face. You still get the highlighted effect, um, and definitely, you know, your contour is definitely out there and looks amazing. So if you want amazing contour, I say get this powder and bake with it because it's absolutely amazing. <laughs> A concealer I have been loving. Now, everybody knows my favorite concealer is my NYX one, but this one I have been mixing with my NYX, and it's uh, thebomb.com. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. Now, for a long time, I never liked this concealer because concealer, I always thought it was too thin, but oh my goodness, this mixed with the NYX one they should make a baby because honestly it's the shit like it's amazing so this is my favorite concealer right now mixed with the NYX one but I really just wanted to show you guys this one and what I have been using to blend it in is this brush right here this is the elf small stipple brush now this is my concealer brush for under my eyes and this is honestly amazing I love using this so these two items are like my favorite for my under eyes right now especially this concealer when I thought I hated it I actually love it so it's an amazing formula it's super thin and lightweight but honestly gives you amazing coverage so I really really like that for a long time I always thought I needed something thick to get a nice coverage like if this is very light but it still gives me awesome coverage I'm like down for it because it doesn't feel so heavy under my eyes so definitely these two things I have been using under my eyes and it's amazing the next two things are another duo that I cannot split up because they are amazing. The very first one I have been loving, this is my NYX. This is a retractable lip liner in Nude, I think it's called. Let me see. It's actually called Natural. So this is what it looks like. Let me swatch it on my hand. It's just a kind of Kylie Jenner brown lip. So I put this on my lips first. I outline my lips, then I color my lips in with this. Then I go in with this pink shade from Rimmel, and it's um, the Rimmel, and this is called East Eastern Snob, maybe. And let me swatch this one for you. Now these two together are like the perfect combo because I have like the brown lip going on, and then I only put this pink in the center of my lips on the top and bottom, and it just adds a little bit of like nice kind of effect to my lips then I'll put velvet teddy over it and let me tell you it's the best lip combo you can ever get because it stays all day and it's like the nicest lip shade for fall so this has been my fall lip shade and it's amazing so this one is super creamy it does not dry out your lips this is the next one in natural and if you want to wear this alone, you definitely can. Um, I just like adding the pink because I feel like it gives a little bit of like maybe definition, I guess you would call it, to your lips. And then it kind of gives it like a more gradient effect so it's not just a pure brown shade on your lips. This pink shade definitely just helps bring out your lips and make your lips look very big. So these two shades have been my go-to shades to make my lips look very big and get me that nice brown nudie shade I love for fall. The very last thing I have to show you guys, and I know this was a short favorites, but honestly, my favorites have just been very short, simple, and sweet, and I really like to keep it that way. Now, this is like my all-time favorite, favorite, favorite mascara right now. It's not even funny. If you want exotic, out there, va va boom lashes, this is the shit. This is like the go-to. Like, if you want an amazing mascara, hello, this is it. This is the Maybelline Last Sensation, and... Um, in waterproof okay the waterproof it's so hard to get off let me just tell you it's so hard to get this mascara off but I don't even care because this mascara is life 
I honestly curl my eyelashes once, twice, and I'll like pump it up with the eyelash curler. Then I put this on. My eyelashes have never looked bigger. And I thought, um, I loved the L'Oreal one, um, a couple of the CoverGirl ones I love. But honestly, this is my favorite, favorite mascara at the moment. It's so amazing. It does my eyelashes wonders. Honestly, it does. My eyelashes look fake when I use this, and I love that look because I can't use fake eyelashes because I wear glasses, and if I use fake eyelashes, they hit my glasses, and it just doesn't work. So, honestly, hands down, if you want fake eyelashes, look, this is the mascara. This will, like, be your go-to mascara, and this is amazing for your bottom lashes as well because I really like the shape of the brush um, because it's nice to get into your bottom lashes with that little scoop part, and you just go swoop, whoop, and you hit your bottom lashes. This mascara, I feel like, is a little bit drier than most mascaras I'm used to, but I feel like... Even though it's like a drier formula, I feel like my eyelashes are getting the bigger effect. So I'm thinking the drier um, formulas will work better on my eyelashes when I always thought what ones do. No, the drier ones work amazing. So definitely try this out if you want very big, amazing lashes. This is it. So this is my all over October favorites. I hope you guys enjoy it. If you're new, please come up to subscribe because it would mean the world to me. And please give this video a huge thumbs up because it helps me so much. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Peace.